What's up guys, it's Jordan here and I am back with another video. Like I said last time, I have cooler stuff planned and that starts now. So today I will be doing a butterfly look. I got inspiration from this picture right here. This is Raggedy Royal. She's one of my favorite makeup artists right now. You should go check her out. Um, but I will be doing a similar look, of course, adding my own twists and turns to it. Um, once again, like I said last time, I make everything up on the spot. So if things go wrong, you know, y'all just gotta bear with me. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be a fun one. So let's get started. <laughs> So we're gonna go ahead and jump right in with the eyes. Um, I use the Tarte Shape Tape Contour Concealer as my eyeshadow primer just because it'll make the colors more pigmented. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my Beauty Blender and blend this all out. So I know I look pretty crazy right now, but now comes the fun part. I basically just make it up from here. So we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna use my James Charles palette again. Um, so first I'm going to use this color right here. I know they have names, but like I lost the little paper that has the names. Honestly, I'm going to be completely honest. I'm not very good with eyeshadow. <laughs> I'm gonna take this smaller brush and go into the crease. I'm going to be using that same blue color, but I'm gonna combine it with this green color right here. And so since my eyelids are hooded, I do have to make my crease a bit higher, um, closer to the eyebrow. Might do a mixture of this one and this one. I did wanna add a little bit of green to this. I think to the outside, it will be fine. Maybe, I don't know. All right, so this is what one eye looks like, um, but I'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye, and yeah, I'll be back. Um, they're kind of even. You see, there's a lot going on. They're not as even as I could get it. Do I care? No. We're gonna go ahead and do a cut crease. Um, I need to fix this crease real quick. I'm gonna take a round flat brush, sure. And I'm gonna go back in with the Shape Tape Concealer. I take a little bit of this and then I put some on my actual lid and then I just, <laughs> I go like this. I go like that so I can see when I blink where the actual crease will cut. So I'm gonna go ahead and just cut along. I'm only gonna cut to like halfway and I'm gonna cut along that crease up there. I'm gonna go ahead and set it with a white powder. Now I'm going to go over where I cut the crease and the white part with this really pretty blue shadow. Um, I don't know if I've ever used it before, but it's really pretty. Thank you, James Charles. And it's not showing up. I resend my statement. That's so pretty. Oh my God, this is giving me like, not the whole thing, but this shadow is giving me very like Elsa, Frozen type. Yeah, we don't have to. I'll have to do something with that. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna blend this out one more time with the other shadows to really make that, you know, blend together. And this is what we have so far. Um, kind of insane. I don't not really. It's okay. I'm going to be using the NYX Matte Liquid Liner. I've been using this liner for so long. Honestly, this is one of the best eyeliners um, that I've ever used. So the liner starts somewhere like where the cut crease is. So I'm gonna make that part really thin. Now 
Thanks guys, I already messed up, so. So I forgot to film it, but if you cared, it looks ugly. <laughs> like, why am I dumb? I don't like that. This is a lot of work. Um, Right now I look like, I don't know, like weird. I look weird. That's basically it. I know once I add like the little designs and stuff, it'll be cute. It'll be something. I'm telling you, I'm making everything up. I'm literally making everything up. <sighs> Y'all, I might have just did something. I might have just did something. Okay, all right, so I just did the other eye. It's looking, okay, this one, it's so uneven, but it's looking good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my skin now so that I can then do the under, the little butterflies under the butterfly, but the ends of the butterflies. You guys already know this stuff, so this is gonna go zoom, 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 zoom. Go ahead. You know it, you know her. My Fenty concealer, and I'm gonna go ahead and apply it everywhere. Beauty blender. Little bronzer. Or should I do blue? No, that's doing too much, Jordan. That's doing too much. A little bit of bakey bake. We got this. We got same same shadows as before. Is that even evil? Whatever. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yes, yes! I'm gonna do the other eye. I'm doing it. We're doing it. It's happening. Um. Does it look like butterflies? No, of course not. But it's going to. Oh my god. But we're just gonna go ahead and do them. So I'm taking another NYX white eyeliner. Should I put a rhinestone there? Let's do it, let's do it. I'm gonna put a rhinestone. What? Who am I? Who am I? Okay, I'm gonna put rhinestones on the little corners. Y'all, come on y'all. Y'all gotta hand it to me. Y'all gotta hand it to me because this was not looking cool in the beginning. But now you see it, and now you see it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and put my lashes on. Today I am using Teddy by Kiss Lash Couture. These are my all time favorites. easy those went on. I'm gonna take my Lash Sensational, she's a beauty, and just mesh my real lashes together. Okay, so I use the NYX Sweet Cheeks Glow Blush. Um, however, it's really, really hard to open, so I have to use my eyebrow scissors. Take a cute little brush. This is very pigmented, so you do need to be a bit careful. My Cover FX little drop thingies. I'm gonna go over it with Urban Decay After Glow Highlighter. And I drop my brush. Here we go, nose highlight. I'm just gonna sit here and do this. I'm gonna do a little freckle action just to be cutesy. So I'm gonna take browsing again but I'm going to um, use the powder part mostly and right now I'm going crazy with a big fluffy brush and just pat them down so I'm taking a brown eye brow pencil and I'm going to line my lips with this all right so I just line my lips and kind of color all of them in um 
Now I'm going to take my favorite lip gloss, Fenty Glow, and just put it all over. All right, so I'm dumb. I forgot that I said I'd be putting rhinestones on the ends of the little um, butterfly tail wings. Um, I got these off of Amazon. They're super cute. I use them for like music festivals, stuff like that. Still so cute. Oh my God, that's so, so put on in the corner. I think I'm just gonna add another one. Eek. Yeah, that's cute. All right, guys, so this is the final look. Um, a lot better than I expected. I honestly had no idea what was gonna happen. Like I told you, I make everything up on the spot. I kind of just go with the flow. Um, but yeah, this is really cool. <laughs> All right, guys thank you so much for watching my video i told you it was gonna be better than the last one i do better with crazy stuff that i can play around with um so if you liked what you saw today please like and subscribe share with your friends tell everyone you know um and yeah stay tuned i have a lot of cool stuff planned so you guys can follow me on instagram and on twitter it's gonna be linked in the bio so yeah i had a lot of fun with this one today Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out.